Separate and make way for wisdom. Never come together because if you did, it would dismiss the trademark of your main identifier. The one, the most high design, keeping you sanctified, not only in your spirit and mind, but in your smile as this gap opens doors and hearts forming a bridge to release prophetic speech. But I can't lie. This gap has challenged me and my self-esteem as a young girl being taunted by little boys who make jokes about my smile while they sing songs by the gap band as I walk by causing me to put my tongue between my teeth when being photographed had me putting my hands over my mouth like Celie when I laughed was told by my parents how beautiful my smile was but it wasn't enough because it was them against the world of cruel people who forgot that there is beauty in imperfections but is it an imperfection I found out later in life that what some see as a flaw was fallacy as I break the fangs of the wicked and snatch the souls of victims from their teeth using my GAP, God, and poetry. Holding unspoken intellect between my teeth while I look for the next space to invade because empty space is opportunity. So while you focus on my gap, I will be forming a gap in your closed mind, making room for knowledge, wisdom, and understanding because I don't want no more people to perish as my words form the missing capacitator, trying to send spiritual insight to the resistor. As God, the source, rekindles divine continuity, your circuit is now complete. God used the symbolic nature of my smile to warm the hearts of the enemy and the midst of them plotting plans to destroy me. God, help me to close the racial gap, the poverty gap, the religion gap, the social gap, the communication gap, so that we can bring understanding between man and woman back. All of this from a gap. So I have a lot of weight on my shoulders as I choose to accept the divine assignment to only have a gap between my teeth and not gaps of unfinished business or responsibilities in my life using the power and the authority of my gap, God, and poetry.